Hi, welcome to Crochet 101 with Trisha Taylor, presented by Craftigami.com. Today we will be working on Fair Isle Crochet. Fair Isle is where you take and you change the colors and when loading the color that's not in use over the back of your previous stitches. Today we're going to talk about Fair Isle Crochet before I show you what we're doing. Okay, if you can see the green yarn is threading through the back of this white yarn and the white yarn is just floating over the back of the green yarn and that's what Fair Isle Crochet is, just floating your yarn over top of each other and for the color changes. So let me show you how it's done. First we're going to work our main color and I'm just doing a single crochet and I'm doing three single crochets in the green and then I'll change over to white and then I'll do three single crochets in the white. So I've got my three green almost done. I have my two loops on my hook. We're going to go ahead and pick up our white yarn or whatever color is your contrasting color. We're going to yarn over and pull it through our green and this will still leave a green top and make it look nice for the last stitch of my green but it has me set and ready for the next color and we're just going to leave this green floating in the back here so we're going to crochet in the first so there's one there's oops two and then three and instead of pulling this through what I'm going to do is actually drop the white and pick up the green and we're going to just pull the green through and if I turn my work over you can see that the green just floated across the back there and that's how you do the fair isle crochet with changing colors we'll show you one more time so we'll do the green one Two, three, and it with this third one, remember, I'm not going to finish it off with the same color. I'm going to drop my green, pick up my white, letting it float across the back here, and then I'm going to pull the white through the green, giving us a nice flowing color change. And we, one thing you need to make sure when you're doing this, when you pick up your color, you don't want to pull this line too tight, otherwise you're going to pucker your work. So just keep it kind of loose, but yet yeah, still flowing. So we'll do the three single crochets, and on the third one, not finish it, drop your color, and then pick up your next color yarn over and pull it through and that's how you do the fair isle crochet thank you for working with me on the fair isle crochet for more tutorials visit craftigami.com